Yeah, man, but I don't know if you, you've been, you know, you've been busy as hell, man. I've been busy too, you know, with everything that I told you um, prior to actually jumping on, but uh, like, this is why I feel start, sorry for Steph Curry, because Aisha Curry, boy, she's for the streets, boy. She proves again, time <laughs> and time again, this dumb is for the streets, you feel me? Like, 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 she's on a show. I think it's the view, you feel me? And they got a butler or whoever coming out, you know, in the back it. with some food or whatever it is. Yeah. I and see when it. she see him, she go like this. Like, I'm about to take off the ring because I want him in my guts. <laughs> <laughs> I look at that shit. I'm like, I show wifey, wifey just shake her head and look down. She don't even want to say nothing. You feel me? I'm like, dog. I mean, first, I think I heard y'all in a open relationship. I know my dime. I know your dime. I know Chris dime. That shit ain't flying. Are you gonna die today? That's what you asking me. That's the question you asking me. That's what, that's what you, you feel. What I'm saying like you gonna die today. That's what you like. Come on, man. You feel me? Like play it all out in your head before you even come to me with that dumbass question because you're not gonna ask that dumbass question. You feel what I'm saying? Open relationship, so I know. I know it's not well. Ho- hopefully, you're not getting handled by some other dudes. I don't think it's that. I think it's probably. You joining in because you like, man, Steph, you know, he's the boy wonder. He got the cat eyes. You feel me? Dom's like him. He's red. He's a a, a four-time winning NBA champion, MVP. You feel me? Any Dom would want to drop a jit with his ass. His kids are beautiful. Mm -hmm. Any Dom want to throw that sack at his ass. So what I got to do as Aisha, man, let me just join the party, man. You feel me? And he's on like, all right, all right, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? Um, even if that was the case, why the hell would you have to tell the world this? Nobody cares. Nobody need to know. I, I think that that's the thing for me. It's like even if this is what y'all agreed upon, because I can mm-hmm. I can see that being agreed upon because they known each other since high school. Right. Yes. Like, and I, for me, like, if I'm with the same girl since high school, you know, and now I'm, you know, Steph Curry, I got millions. Everybody knows me. I'm one of the greatest players to ever play. And I asked my Don, like, hey, you know what I'm saying? Let me get just, you know, a night, <laughs> a night or two. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like, and if they agreed upon it, that's their business, you know. But exactly. like, I, I don't, I don't think it's our business to know about it. You know what I'm exactly. saying? Exactly. That's why she for the streets because it makes you look like you're punk, and it makes her look like she for the streets. You know what I'm saying? It's just the optics of it. The 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 perception of it looks looks bad. And the th- the same thing with the whole ring taking the ring off. It's like. I know people people play around like that. Uh women play around like that. Not um, on national TV. Exactly. That was gonna be exactly my point. Like, I know people play around. I'm not gonna admit that I do. 
Yes, I'm not yes, going yes. to admit that I do. And most people wouldn't admit that they do something to that degree or say something to that degree to their boys or their girls when they chilling, having yeah, drinks, cool. doing yeah, stuff, chilling, yeah. whatever. You know, whatever you do on your time with your peoples, your friends, your circle, that's your business. But yes. you on national TV. And you hey, you're a, a role model. You're, you're a, a role social, model. You're in a social media uh, era where everything, anything you do is going to be uh, a, a million likes, uh, you know, a million views, you know, especially you being in the limelight. Not only you're just somebody on TV, everybody knows who you are. And, and you're your not, kid, everybody knows yeah, Riley. Everybody knows everybody. who you are. Everybody knows your husband. You are a, 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 a semi-celebrity in your own right. Mm -hmm. So people are going to, you know, have certain opinions about it. And then all of a sudden it's a story. Don't make it a story if you don't have to. Mm -hmm. Is all I'm saying. Like, mm -hmm. why, why are you creating this narrative for people? Because I know Steph Curry's boys is calling him like, yo, you seen, you seen what Aisha did today? And he, he got to explain like, it. He got to be like, oh, she, yeah, she was just, playing around like that. Just playing. You Meanwhile, know, like, you're 38. Right. He got he he got to go through all that, and no man wants to go through that. <laughs> News flash. No man wants to have to explain something that their wife did that is considered to be um, inappropriate. Yeah, make you look like a mutt. You feel me? And you make me look like a simp. You feel me? Yeah. I'm sorry. They already call me pretty boy, and they probably look at me like I'm soft just because I look right. a certain way. That's why he grew yeah. the damn beard. Everybody think he's I'm, I'm younger than he is, but you know he's subconscious of how he damn look. You feel me? Yeah. Had to grow the damn beard. You com look completely different with that beard. You feel me? But hey, it is what it is. But yeah, man, like come on, Aisha. And then you look at your name. You got to get on name, Aisha. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, come on. You just proving the point. Proving the point even more. <laughs> I do not understand why people do this. Like, again, at the end of the day, people want to do, do their thing in their in they own personal life. That's perfectly fine. But I don't think that it is um, appropriate for you to, 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 to have that on national television. Like, did you not see Ja? He's a role model. He flashed the gun. 25 games. Did you not know? Like, come on, man. Certain things you can't do, and 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 she probably like, man. I ain't. I, I didn't choose to be no damn role model. Yeah, that's what y'all saying. That's what Ricky Williams was saying when he was smoking trees. I mean, now it's legal in plenty of states, this, that, and the other. But at that time, he was a role model. Even yeah. though I think that there was crabbing just for a joint or whatever like that. But again, you're a public figure. You need to hold yourself to a certain standard. Again. Don't like talking politics too. And but again, you got Trump. You got Trump, he talks. And you know, when you offend a lot of people and say a lot of things, you may be saying some factual shit, but it's how you say it. People not gonna listen to you, people because you represent the United States, you re represent the citizens of the United States. So you gotta hold yourself yeah. to a certain standard, not just Trump, but people in politics, period officers every teachers you feel me you got teachers that's getting fired because they have only fans again like this is yeah. the stuff that we're talking about when you're in a certain limelight and you're a certain figure in society i know it's not fair trust me i agree with you you should be able to do what the fuck you want but again at the end of the day that's not how it works you feel me everybody know life is not fair you feel me but again for you doing that, this is something that you brought on to yourself. That's why I don't feel sorry for Ja. That's why I don't feel sorry for Aisha making me think you a big ass mutt. You feel me? Again, it is what it is. Again, yeah. look, a, 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 a leopard has spots and she got spots. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I ain't got nothing else to say about Aisha Curry, but uh, you did bring up Ja. I don't feel sorry for him either because, hey, you got to you gotta know better and you got to do better. You know, the point blank i mean you already got busted for for having a gun in the strip club or whatnot and then again you do you do it again and then you try to say that it was a toy gun i wasn't buying that at all nobody's buying that shit especially when that explanation comes weeks oh, after the, yes. the whole thing comes out weeks after like if it was a toy gun it would have been immediate like oh yo it's a toy no 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 like come on man like i, this I think it's just 
he's just tripping, man. And I, I think he he did right by you know taking himself off off of social media. He needs to stop hanging around uh, the dudes around him because obviously uh, they they influence him in the wrong way. And at the same time, he's trying to be somebody he's not. You know, he he's not a gangster. You are not a gangster. You know what I'm saying? I'm not, I'm- like, Sharp said it best, you know. I don't even need to say any more be, behind this guy. We had our our episode on his ass, and he's still doing the same thing. That episode like two months ago. So um yeah, ain't nobody yeah. worried about John no more. What I am worried about is Zion. <laughs> See, I was actually going to tr- transition. <laughs> Me and you were on the same page. Here and I was gonna say, yeah, I don't feel sorry for Aisha. I don't feel sorry for um uh John Morant, but I kind of feel sorry for what Zion is going through right now. You know what I'm saying? Like this this bitch is crazy. She crazy. You know what I'm saying? She is every cheating man or woman's worst nightmare. <laughs>